Welcome back, guys, to more Fallout 4. We finished all of the Children of the Atom quests. They are our friends. We love them. They love us. Everything is great, even though I decontaminated the radiation system that they love so much. Oops. But anyway, okay, so we did all of that. I wanted to do that before we go after the next thing, because it might anger them, although it probably won't. I'm not really sure. We'll find out. This is the quest we're doing, Best Left Forgotten. We've got to, uh, we're going after Dima's earliest memories that he stored in a uh, terminal here. This is his old base and the Children of the Atom. They're the, ch yeah, Children of the Atom. They took it over. We've got to go retrieve it. That mumbled praying, that could really... Consider yourself warned. Warned what? Oh, okay. Probably shouldn't be drawing a gun on them. Anyway, Nucleus Command Center. Sneak and enter. So I walked through this door very briefly when I first got here. Uh, I didn't really do anything. I didn't go beyond this first little room. No, no accounting for taste. Well, I'm picking up stuff to build other things, dude. Come on. I have not gone anywhere past here. I think I may be military. I don't know what that does, military. I picked up a few of those. I didn't go past here, I don't think. So I took the ammo out of those. So we've got a tunnel there, and then some kind of booby-trapped trapped corridor. And, oh, why is it telling us to go back that way? What is this all about, these symbols here? It was, uh, it had the, oh, there's power armor there as well. Huh. Okay, I'll have to go pick that up later. Did I see that before and forget about it? I might have. So, we could go through this corridor, tell you what, let's go just a little bit and see if I can defuse these, uh, tripwires. And also look, yeah, I think that's a mine, or is that just a piece of rock? Is that a mine or a rock? It's just a rock. Okay, but we got dead people here. Let's not make their mistake, well, I should be able- that looks like fun. Yeah, I can just do this. If I can click on it. Okay. Oh, I have to do both sides? There we go. Yeah, that's all it takes. Okay, I guess we can go this way. I will explore both avenues. Try to get all the loot we can. That looks like a D-pad on an NES controller, doesn't it? But that's not too hard to do. Whoa! Okay. <laughs> I spoke too quickly. <laughs> Almost. Oh, that was really close. I can't believe I didn't trip that. In fact, I might even have a perk where I don't trip them. That's possible. I definitely don't trip pressure plates or mines. Um, so maybe I've got a sneak perk for that. Oh, that's right. I leveled up. I've got a, a level up. Okay, after, as soon as I def defuse this, disarm it. There we go. Okay. So, the level up perk tree. Here we go. We are level 39, which means, yes, that day has arrived. Gun Nut 4. Pow. Next level. Let's see, next level will be 40. We can't get Science 4 until level 41, but we can take, I think, Rifle... No. 42. We need something for level 40. I'm sure it's here. Maybe Armorer 4 is what we'll take. Pretty awesome. Getting all of the super duper endgame levels up now. And we will be able to make some cool stuff once we have that science four as well as the gun the gun nut four. All the weapon upgrades will be ours. Okay, what oh. Uh oh. That sounded like a robot. Might be uh Dima's defenses. As opposed to the Children of the Atom. Kind of seems like Children of the Atom don't even come in here. Oh, uh, yeah. Whoa. Legendary Lieutenant Gutsy. Two-shot, 44 pistol. Look at all this stuff. Holy cow. Thank you, Lieutenant Gutsy. I don't think we're alone. Wow, Nick, you think? Okay, reload. Okay, I think we're gonna be all right, though. Uh, this power armor is not modified to carry a ton of weight, though. I need to do that next time I, uh, I 
head back to the base. Facility announcement terminal. Hmm. Okay, let's uh, let's get into that in a second. Honor Green Jets, don't want that. Last radius, don't want that. This stuff, I do want. Uh, but yeah, I will modify this once we get back. Modifying takes materials, and I'm real low on materials right now, which is why I'm picking up everything. So I might not be able to modify it that much. Repairing armor suits takes a lot as well. It takes a lot of materials. And this is actually, this is my ninth suit of power armor. I counted, <laughs> and I've moved all the ones to the base. I guess next time I go back to the base, maybe I'll try to show the base. Got them all lined up. Starting to look pretty impressive. Guess we could take a little naparoo if we wanted. Okay, let's, uh, can I, do I have to get out of my power armor? No, okay. Uh, by order of Captain Wabash, submarine containment leak detected. General evacuation protocols in effect. All personnel report to designated evac zones. Oh. Oh, load holotape? No, I don't want to load holotape. Oh, that was Nick. Oh my god, that scared me, Nick. What is this? Machine... Oh, it's a turret. Okay, here we go. Further and further, deeper and deeper. Okay, that robot... I'm gonna just make an assumption that he's already active. Yes, he's moving. Oh, oh. Right there. how do you see me from there? We'll see you last hand. Nick! Come on, Nick. You need to get better about that. Yeah, that's one way to get that cool and pumping. Yeah. Got some. Okay, anything else in this area? Nick, come on, dude. Any turrets? Okay, I think we're okay. Okay, not so bad so far. Could get worse. Probably will. Possibly not. Fusion cell stuff. Want it going to waste now, would we? Oh, and I need to remember to uh, to give Nick my stuff from my inventory when I fill up. I, I always forget to do that. I'm reminding myself now. Should I run out of inventory space, just give it to Nick. Don't need to head back. Door open. Okay, let's take a look in this little room before we head f further. What's that? Just when I thought we were getting along. Nuka-Cola. Oh, you know what? I never did look at uh, what that... The Vim drink I got last time does. So let's see. Vim does hit points and ability points. Captain's Blend does 600 hit points. Whoa. And sea creatures are more hesitant to attack you. That's pretty funny. And negative two charisma. Wow. And then I got Vim Quartz, 15 carry weight, AP and hit points. Where's Brew? Negative 100. Okay, cool. Probably some real caps to be made from all this scrap. You think? Maybe not caps, but uh, definitely some more base modifications are inbound on their way. Give me all that. Cigarettes. Got saucepan, cooking pots. Just, I'm just gonna run to the side and click the pickup button. Okay. Oh, this is a refrigerator. I get it. Okay. I don't think I'm gonna want anything in here, unless there's a huge chunk of a meat or something. I can't actually pick that up. All right. So let's head back. Through that door, I found there's a pot there. That's probably made of iron or steel or whatever. Oh, and a bathroom. Always, these always have like stim packs and stuff. There we go. Out of the way, Nick. They've made, uh, they've done a lot of, they made a lot of progress with having your companions get out of the way so they don't block doorways. I really appreciate that because. That's, that was one of the major reasons I didn't use companions before. I still kind of prefer to go do it solo, but uh, Nick, I, I like Nick. Nick has grown on me. He's probably one of the cooler NPCs I've seen in a Fallout series. 
He said something earlier when I was uh, not recording about uh, something he needed to take care of. I think it's going to be a quest. Scanners detecting sentient Whoa! Life. Oh, God. Okay, we're doing bats for this. These guys move fast. Too bad he's dead. Suck it. Uh, is he dead? Could we consider him to be alive? Not that it's an option. Yeah, sure, Nick. Whatever, Nick. Oh, and I'm carrying too much. Okay, so, Nick, guess what? How? Psst. Watch the... We need to trade. Oh, you got all this stuff? I probably gave you this a long time ago and totally forgot. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, uh, you ha take that. And that, and that. Radical conversion. Take that. And that. Wismo Gizmo, that's mine. Two shot, 44. You can have that. Okay, music. You can calm down. Calm down, music. And then, let's see. I'm only down to 297. I probably have some miscellaneous stuff. I wish I could sort... Oh, I can. Um, what am I sorting by? Value by weight. Okay, Carrington's prototype. That weighs f five. Hmm. Junk, that's what I want. I want to sort this by weight. There we go. Deathclaw hide, eight. Yeah, there we go. Um, I wonder if it'll tell me when he gets encumbered. But that's probably good oh, yeah. enough. Uh, the plan is that we keep going. Is this the right way? Am I going backwards? Uh, I think this is the right way. Okay, Nick. Thank you, music, for calming down a little bit. Oh, you're going to come back, aren't you, music? I can feel it. We've already been here. Oops. I was going the wrong way. All right, let's do a little bit of catch up. Okay, this is where we were. Give me all that. Look out for turrets. Unidentified intruder hostile target. Like that. And let's use some vats. Let's oh my crit bar's already full, but let's kill him in vats anyway. Oh, okay. Kill. Kill. Oh, I I got rid of the head armors. You know what? Did I get him? He did! Alright, sweet. Grab everything. Already took the stuff out of there. We're not very far from our objective. That looks like a, a quick exit right there. The nucleus. Oh, yeah, it is. Okay. Uh, that is the way out when we're done. That's the turret. Technical documents. Just kind of grab everything, I guess. Why not? Take all your stuff. Okay. Command center terminal. Attention, submarine leak. Okay, open the door though. Accessing maglox. It's not, I'm hitting tab, but it doesn't let you uh, jump out. Oops, jump out right away. All right, that's what we need to access. We're here, this is exciting. I'm kind of really interested to find out what's in these memories. I wonder if this story is gonna throw a twist at us right here. Whatever's in here, uh, Dima does not remember. He had to store it long time ago. Uh, and I'm, I'm just going to look around first because uh, after I look at that, I'm gonna, I want to be ready to leave. It's always a good idea to look at stuff first. Auxiliary... P oh. Whoa. Oh, alarms. Uh-oh. That's not good. Oh. Crap. Crap. Legendary Assaultron Invader. Okay. Okay, this is maybe the wrong weapon? I don't know. Out for you. Oh my gosh, my health. Have been programs to efficiently terminate human combatants. Here you go. Okay, handgun. And... 
Oops. You're in for it now. No, I'm gonna die. Ah. Okay. Uh, did I die? Oh, I think it got me. Holy crap, that was scary. Okay, so this time, let's try accessing the terminal before turning the power on, although I suspect... Aha, uh -huh, auxiliary power off. Right, okay, so we have to turn the power on and kill that thing before we can get access to it. This time, I shall try to be more prepared. Here we go. Um. Alright, activate. Are you ready, Nick? It's coming from... Right through here. Okay. Torso. A better hit percentage. Bam! Oh, yeah, much better damage this time. She's gonna mutate, though. Yeah. How does a robot mutate? Can you answer me that? Riddle me this, Batman. Okay. Okay. Uh, keep it shooting. <laughs> Rapid fire handgun silencer. Oh god. Okay, it was them back. It blew up on us, Nick. Holy moly. I guess that was probably uh Dima's defense system right here. Cavalier sends left arm. I guess I'll sell this later. Unless you're hounding for a green suntan, I suggest we get a move on. Oh shut up, Nick. You're such a spoil sport sometimes. Pick that up, I guess. I'm not encumbered. Good. Okay, let's reload everything in case there's any other surprises. And we should be able to look... Ooh. There's a brain how it, like... Oops. Like, uh... Doc Brown used. And this thing I haven't used in here because of the range. Okay. Well, let's do another little quick save. And here we go. Unlock. With Faraday's program. Oh, we have to get out of the power armor. Out of my pimpin' red... You've got Vim power armor. Welcome to Robco Termlink. Okay, we've logged in. Long-term memory storage. Oh, and some locked ones. Oh, okay, here we go. First one. Icebreaker override. What? Oh, man. Okay. We've entered the Matrix simulation. Oh, it's if like... If you're listening to this, then you made it inside my memory banks. Take a moment. I know it's a lot at once. Little bugs. Okay. Retrieve memory. OV9AXO. This is like building a settlement. The architecture you're seeing is uh -huh. data. My data. Got it. When I'm plugged into the chair, this is what I see. Uh huh. Little bugs. You're using an earlier version of that technology, a brainwave scanner instead of a direct neural wire. Right. Look around. Do you see that yellow column in the distance? Yeah, I see That's it. That's long-term memory storage. So we have to get over there. That's your goal. Okay. But you can't just retrieve that data yourself. No kidding. One of the programs loaded in that holotape is called the Indexer. Mm -hmm. They're represented by the friendly green sprites milling around. Oh, these Did things. You see them? They're friends? Oh, they're friends. Hey. The indexers have one purpose: to get the data in the yellow column. Oh, I see. We've got to let. Th we've got to connect a path so they can get over there. I get it. Okay, I get you it. Need to help them get there. Yeah, I get it. Back safely. I get it. Thank you. Once they've recovered all the data in the memory, the program will translate it into something you can understand. Okay. If you ever need to leave the simulation, then don't worry. Nothing gets reset. Okay. You can keep going from wherever you left off. Oh, nice. First things first. The blue blocks you're standing on are called code blocks. Code blocks. Some of them can be repurposed. They like moved. See if you can grab one of the lighter colored blocks. Use them to fill in any gaps along the path for your indexers to cross. Good. You're across the gap. Oh wow, low gravity. Now you have to deal with the security systems. Okay, let's put this down. That red firewall is blocking you and your indexers from reaching the oh, data. I see, and that goes through here. 
Did I move this? Green beam did I rotate it? That's a decoder beam. Yeah, yeah. It can destroy the firewall. Yeah, I get it. You just need to direct the beam to its vulnerable spot. Do I click this side? Oh. Um. There we go. Kerblamo. Pretty cool. I bet those little guys are bad. The red bad blue good green friend. <laughs> That's what all this stuff means. Good. Now you just need to create a path to the data with code blocks, mm -hmm. and your indexers can get to work. Yep, I get it. I get it. Okay, so we need to cross this gap. This is pretty cool. I like this. Nice little diversion. If there's too much, I can see it maybe getting a bit tedious, but it's... Uh, I like it. Nice little mini-game. A lot of times these mini-games are kind of... Like, what? This is, a, I think, a little bit better than the... Um, What's his name? Kellogg? I was, every time I try to think of Kellogg's name, I'm like, okay, it's the guy that's the breakfast cereal. What's breakfast cereal names? Oh, yeah, Kellogg's. Okay, little guys. Go get him. What about those things? Come on, little fellas. There you go. You can do it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Um, what do I do about them? The system has been alerted to your presence. Now things will get hairier. Hairier. You'll need to deploy defense constructs against the system's active countermeasures. But you, but you, but you, get them. The sentries will do everything they can to stop your indexers from returning to the access point with oh, the Oh, I see. Okay. All right, go get him, turret. He's right there. Get a max range. Go get him. There we go. Kerplow, got you. So we've got to give them a safe path all the way through there. So then they get to the uh, memory. And do they have to go all the way back to the blue beam? Blue beam to orange beam and back? Or do they just have to get here? I could probably... You are not in a good spot. You can't see anything. So let's move you back over here. And those guys will have to retrieve the code. Lock recovered. Let's put Good. one, uh... Just keep doing what you're doing. I will. Yeah, they're popping up all over. So, we, like, there, one just popped up there. I Sentry, need to... beginning erasure protocol against unauthorized indexer. What? Okay, uh, let's see. What else do I have here? This is a decoder relay. Oh, right. So I can't build those ones. That's that beginning over there. Beginning of intrusive program. And I used all of my turrets, which I don't think can be destroyed. Uh, okay, let's move one of you over to here. Now at 60%. Whoa, okay, gravity. 80%. Oh, okay, that killed that one. Detected active intrusive program. Yeah, did you now? Okay, let's see uh, if I can do anything else here. Little buggy guys are going. I guess I could make uh, the path not quite as narrow in spots. I wonder if that would help them. Their pathing. Sentry initiating erasure of intrusive indexer. Get rid of any bottlenecks. There's a bunch of blocks over here. Uh, it's probably a little bit too late for that. But it's either that or sit around twiddling my thumbs. So I guess we'll familiarize ourselves more. Intrusive program detected. With this puzzle mechanic. Look at that thing. I wonder if I could jump down there. It would probably kill me if I go through that mesh, though. Um, I think the turrets... I don't know I don't know if I can place the turrets in a better pattern. I think they're pretty much as good as they're gonna be. This little buggy guy is on his way back. I think... Sentry initiating erasure of intrusive indexer. Oh, really? Here's another block. Widen that up. I bet I could Verifying jump. Memory file. Oh, wow. Look at all this 100%. jumpy puzzle stuff I could do. We're done here. All right. We now have an access point into the next memory. Oh, I see. So Just I... Just step into the data stream where this memory was stored. Aha. Uh -huh. Or I could leave the terminal and then access the next memory. When I first access the terminal, that... All the other memories are locked. Things are not going well. Several of my people have been assaulted. 
it's Nada. Interrogated for no reason. This is getting out of control. But there's still a chance they can learn to trust us. We just need one of their own who's on our side. I can't let anyone know what I'm about to do. Oh my. I'll need to set up the equipment far away from Acadia. They'll double us place to bury the evidence. Oh, I see. Hmm. I bet he started the fog and then he fixed it to gain their trust. That's my hunch. Anyway, um, that's going to be the end of this episode. This is really interesting. And we will investigate this stuff next time. We will do more of these puzzles. Get more information. Dive deeper down the rabbit hole. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for more. We'll see you again next episode. See you later. Bye-bye.